Hi, my name is Karen Marie and welcome to my channel. Today's video is a pattern review of the Tilly and the Buttons Pearl Cardigan. This is not a new pattern, but I've just recently made it up. Uh, so I thought I'd give you a little review what I thought of it. Uh, but first of all, <laughs> I think I have to say that you must think that I live in my car. I don't. <laughs> It's just that I am struggling to find the time um, at home to do the filming. So I like to do the filming while I'm waiting for my daughters when they are at the after school activities and etc. So right now I'm waiting for my daughter uh, outside her ballet school. <laughs> um, so anyway, uh, the, the pattern review. I thought I'd say a little bit about the pattern itself and how I found the sewing up of it and how it fits and maybe just a little bit about Tilly and the Buttons as a pattern company. Uh, the Pearl Cardigan was released, I can't remember, but a good while ago now, maybe a couple of years even. Uh, I bought the pattern when it was new uh, because I thought it would be a very wearable um, cardigan to have in my wardrobe. So I have a, I have a ready to wear cardigan that's kind of cropped and with short sleeves that I wear a lot. And it is 10 plus years old now. It's, it's nothing fancy either. It's it's kind of like uh, probably like H&M or something like that but it's been with me for a very long time and it's starting to show <laughs> um, so I wanted to make um, something similar. The one that I have is not a wrap cardigan but it's kind of the same feel to it. Um, the thing is that I don't really um, I don't really wear sleeveless uh, items <laughs> in public. Um, I don't feel comfortable um, showing my upper arms uh, in public. So I, that sounds really narrow-minded. But you know, it's just that, you know, I don't feel comfortable <laughs> and we should all feel comfortable. So um, whenever I make like a camisole or a top or uh, or something that's sleeveless or a dress, I want to be able to put a little cardigan or, um, I don't know, a shawl or something like that, just to be a little more uh, covered. Um, and the ready-to-wear one, uh, the cardigan that I have, I've been wearing for a, <laughs> a very, very long time. And I put that thing over pretty much any, any sleeveless top that I have. It's black. So um, I'm not saying that it fit, you know, it's perfect with everything, but it's sort of, it's easy to match with things. Um, so uh, I bought the pearl cardigan because that sort of fits the bill. Um, and the pearl cardigan comes in several different options. It's a crop, a wrap cardigan, um, but it, you can make it with a long straight sleeve or a balloon sleeve. Or you can make it um, in a short sleeve, which is what I did. The reason why I made it short sleeved was because I figured that I could still then wear it in summer, even though it's black. Um, and um, I could also wear it underneath uh, other things like today I'm wearing it underneath one of my several Heather um, blazers. The Friday Pattern Company Heather Blazer. <laughs> this is in a green wool, by the way, uh, that I bought locally. Um, and the, the pearl cardigan short sleeve would be like more overall wearable, I think. So um, I made mine in a very lightweight uh, organic jersey. Um, it was perhaps a little bit more lightweight than would be uh, preferable for the uh, pattern um, so it's more of a it's almost like a t-shaped weight actually but I thought if I'm going to wear it in the summer I still wanted to be um, not too heavy um, as I plan on wearing it over uh, sleeveless tops and, and dresses. Tilly and the buttons draft for a height of five 
105, I think, or 168 centimeters. Uh, I am almost like I'm between 5'6 and 5'7. Um, so I decided to lengthen the pearl cardigan with approximately one inch. And I'm really glad I did because I know it's supposed to be cropped, but my torso is longer in proportion to my <laughs> body height. So I didn't want to have like a super cropped um, top. So I lengthened it and I'm glad I did. However, because I lengthened it a little bit, um, it now, it kind of poofs out just a little bit above the waist. So I think um, if I were to make it again, I would probably just um, take it in just a tiny bit right under the bust to make it fit a little bit better, better there. Um, it sews up beautifully and uh, fast and the pattern instructions are very good. Uh, there is a video online uh, on YouTube uh, from Tilly and the Buttons themselves that show you how to finish off uh, the sort of keyhole where you, where you put the, the, um, the bands through and that was very helpful. Um, Tilly and the Buttons are of course very well known for, for their pattern instructions. And I, I mean, it, it's no problem, but I do prefer um, line drawings and Tilly and the Buttons, at least they did in this um, particular um, pattern, they have images, or pictures. That's not my favorite. I never find them as clear to follow as like line drawings and things like that. So. However, the, it's, uh, the pattern is so straightforward that um, it's, it's not going to be a problem. Um, would I make it again? Yes, I think so. Um, it's a sweet little pattern and I think I would probably make it up the next time in a longer sleeve and maybe with the longer balloon sleeve in a, in a cotton jersey with a bit more heft to it. Um, so, so that I can use it more like in the winter time. Um, this is the only Tilly in the Buttons pattern that I have uh, made up. I know they are super popular and I, they have some patterns that I, that I really like, like the Lyra. Um, however, it's not really an aesthetic that I'm drawn to most of the time. Um, the Pearl Cardigan was the first pattern that I saw from them that I thought oh, I gotta have that. <laughs> I don't have any other plans to make any other Tilly and the Buttons patterns. Of course if they do release something that I just have to have then of course I'll buy it. I don't have anything, I don't have a problem with them or anything but it's just not a pattern company that makes a style that I'm particularly drawn to. Um, yeah, is that it? I think so. <laughs> I'm going to put in some pictures, um, of course, uh, of my mate. And I hope that if you have any thoughts about the pearl cardigan or any of the other Tilly and the Buttons patterns or any questions for me, you could just leave it in a comment below. Thank you. Bye.